Good morning. Welcome to the forecast discussion for May 17th, 2016. It's 9.30 a.m. and it is well, pretty much where we should be almost for this time of year. We have temperatures in the upper 40s to lower 50s over the far northern interior, mid to upper 50s over the northern suburbs of New York City, upper 50s to lower 60s over the rest of the region, with winds from the southwest at around 5 to 10 miles per hour with increasing clouds and a few scattered showers. For today, look for scattered showers throughout the region as an area of low pressure passes to our south and a couple of frontal boundaries kind of meander around the region and start to wash out. These showers will be light for the most part, but a few heavy downpours are possible, especially over southern New Jersey. Look for highs today in the lower to mid 60s, which again is below normal for this time of year. We should be in the lower to mid 70s for highs at this time of year. On the infrared satellite picture, you can see one stationary boundary to our north, another stationary boundary over the Tennessee River Valley, and a warm front lifting up from the Gulf of Mexico and through the Gulf Coast. These frontal boundaries will lift up towards our neck of the woods, producing periods of showers today on through tomorrow morning with clearing skies by the time we get to tomorrow afternoon evening. So if you have outdoor plans for tomorrow evening, say you're going to a baseball game, conditions should be improving nicely. However, for this evening, it looks like we're going to be dealing with scattered showers on and off throughout the entire northern mid-Atlantic. On the latest radar, you can see these showers. Now, again, we're not looking for anything that's heavy, and we're not seeing anything that's going to support widespread constant rainfall. But just on and off showers, a heavy downpour from time to time, a little bit of drizzle, just are kind of a raw period of weather for today on through tomorrow with an onshore flow as these areas of pressure pass to our south. The bulk of the steadiest heavy rainfall is going to be over Virginia and Maryland and clipping southern New Jersey. So let's dive into this forecast. For today, look for periods of showers becoming more widespread as we head towards this evening. These showers will be heavy at times, but most locations can experience light showers with periods of drizzle temperatures rising into the lower to mid 60s showers will linger on through the overnight period into tomorrow morning with lows in the lower 50s by tomorrow afternoon the showers start to push off the region as high pressure builds into the area look for clearing skies by tomorrow evening highs tomorrow in the upper 60s to lower 70s and for thursday high pressure in complete control with clear skies Lows in the upper 40s to lower 50s, highs in the upper 60s to lower 70s. As we head towards this weekend, unfortunately, it looks like it's going to be a bit unsettled. On Friday, high pressure is going to be in control with clear skies and tranquil weather conditions. Look for lows in the lower to mid 50s, highs in the lower to mid 70s, so pretty much where we should be for this time of year. Unfortunately, an area of low pressure all along the Gulf Coast is going to lift up towards the Ohio River Valley and then redevelop off of the Mid Atlantic Coast. Look for increasing clouds on Saturday morning with showers by the time we get to the afternoon. Lows will be in the mid-50s, highs in the mid to upper 60s. Saturday night into Sunday, this low pressure system will meander off of the Mid-Atlantic coast, producing waves of showers and heavy rainfall at times. We'll have to watch to see just how strong this low pressure gets and how far north it gets, as there's potential for some pretty strong northeasterly winds around 10 to, 50, 10 to 20 miles per hour gusting to 30 miles per hour if the slow pressure system intensifies off the southern New Jersey coast. Look for period of showers, raw conditions, drizzle, not exactly the best weather for outdoor activities. On Sunday, look for lows in the upper 40s to lower 50s, highs in the mid to upper 60s. On Monday, the area low pressure meanders off of the mid-Atlantic coast where periods of showers heavy at times Look for lows in the mid-50s, highs in the upper 60s to lower 70s. And same thing on Tuesday, that low pressure system does not want to leave with periods of showers. Now again, this isn't steady rainfall for four days. This is waves of showers coming off the Atlantic Ocean. In between those showers, overcast skies, a little bit of sun every once in a while, and periods of drizzle. So it's not steady rainfall for four straight days, but it's waves of showers and rainfall rotating in from the Atlantic Ocean, revolving around this low pressure system. Highs on Tuesday, mid to upper 50s for lows, should I say. Highs in the upper 60s to lower 70s. So a raw wet weather pattern remains in place. 
with temperatures at most warming up to near normal for a few days before falling back into below normal anomalies once again. That's your forecast discussion for today. Thank you for following NYNJPA weather, and as always, stay safe out there.